Sharpen your axe. Once upon a time, a new woodcutter asked for a job in a timber merchant. The pay was really good, and the boss was a nice wise man and the general working conditions was good. For those reasons, the woodcutter was determined to do his best to get permanent job with the merchant. His boss gave him axe and a bag of tools and showed him the area where he would work and all the trees he can fell. The first week, the woodcutter felled 20 trees. Congratulations, the boss said. That is great job and go on that way, added the boss. Motivated by his boss's words, the woodcutter tried harder the next week but he could only fell 16 trees. The third week, he tried even harder, but he could only manage to fell 12 trees. From week to the next, he finished with felling fewer trees. The boss visited him the third week and the woodcutter talked about his decrease in productivity. He said, I must be losing my strength, and he apologized, saying that he could not understand what was going on. When was the last time you sharpened your axe? The boss asked. Sharpen? I have had no time to sharpen my axe. I have been so busy trying to cut as many trees as possible, and I never had time for sharpening my axe. The surprising thing is that he has not even done it once in the last three months, but a good woodcutter sharpens his axe at least once a day, and the only reason why he could not cut more trees was because of his axe. Moral, remember that every day is a brand new opportunity to recharge, renew, and refine yourself. Devote some moments into sharpening your axe instead of chopping away doggedly. Start working smarter instead of just working harder and longer. Increase your personal productivity by having a balanced strategy to renew yourself in the four aspects of life, physical, social, mental, and spiritual. Eating well, sleeping well, and exercising well. Having a good social life by building meaningful connections with others. Learning something new by reading books or referring your source of info. Expanding spiritual self through meditation and relaxation. Thank you for watching. Do not forget to subscribe. We have more than 100 interesting moral stories for you. video and inspire others. Like this video and inspire me. Stay positive and stay blessed wherever you are.